No, no, no. Hey, you cannot use this road without a permit. I'm not parking. I just dropped off a package. Well, now, the sign doesn't say anything about packages, does it? It says permits, and you don't have one. This is not a through street. Have a nice day, sir. Every time you come in here, that means one of the residents can't park in front of their home. You know, the other guys don't do this. The guys with the white trucks. How come it's always you brown guys? And I don't mean that racially. Good afternoon. How can I help you? Yeah, we got a reservation. I'll certainly just need to see your ID. I have you for one night in one of our Creekside cabins. Thank you, Miss Jones. Mark, there's a young woman downstairs asking for you. What kind of car he had? Oh, he, he, he was on foot. Then where'd you do it? He was real nice. Then what? They, they drove off. Why'd you wait to come in? All righty. Thank you, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Funny thing about Buckhannon. People have long memories. It's not always best to go digging things up. The truth. Okay, Albert. The truth is, two kids died. And the man that most people think is responsible just up and vanished. Hey, how's it going? Hello, come on, Rizzo. <gasps> hey, Rizzo. Who's a good girl? Oh, I bet you're loving this weather go for walks in that. Oh, yeah, she's loving it. So I think what you'll find with your documentary is that small government doesn't equal bad government. We have a, a ton of talented people working all across the state. The mayor in Indiana, she's a PhD. She teaches at the university. Look, I think Trey speaks for all of us when he says hey, that... Trey speaks. Shut your mouth, Frisco. If it wasn't for Trey, we would have all frozen to death in Smithport. In on it? Just listen to me. No, Albert, you listen to me. Do you have a body? What? Did you find Verdant's body? No. You got a murder weapon? No. You got a confession? No. No body. No murder weapon, no confession. Buddy, you ain't got shit. 